Hi crafty friends, it's Sylvia. How's everyone doing today? So today guys, we're going to do an unboxing from Diamond Art Club and this is a square and it's called Dragon Artist by Nini Thomas and this painting is actually stunning guys. It's absolutely beautiful. All right, so here on the box, the box is very shiny. It says scan me to unlock for 10% off and the back it basically tells you the instructions step by step and it also tells you what's inside the kit in three languages English French and Spanish okay so let's open this baby up so how's everyone today is everyone having a wonderful day here in Texas the weather is absolutely beautiful guys but of course terrible allergies all right let's see I'm just gonna get the canvas out it's a big one yep oh yeah Okay, so all the Diamond Art Club paintings come in a plastic bag and they say Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle, but I always say do what makes you happy. So we're going to look at that later. And then all the, these paintings come with two stickers, a small sticker and a big sticker. You could actually put them in the logbook or uh, you could actually put the smaller one, so you peel it here, and you can put the small one on your box especially if you store your boxes and that way if you put this on the bottom or on the or on the top of the box you can see what painting is in that box okay and of course this is the toolkit I apologize about my sniffles I can't I can't control that guys it's just out of control my allergies all right let's see what's in the kit put that aside we don't need that right now so it comes with resealable bags so you can put your drills in here just in case you don't have your containers with you all right and then let's see you have well let's look at the pen first it's a yellow pen it's got a single placer and you also have two multi placers so i believe this is a four and this is a seven with a seven you could actually pick seven drills with the four you could pick up four drills at a time and then of course this is a comfort grip this is supposed to help with your hands. Sometimes I can get it in, sometimes I can't. Today's gonna be one of those days that I can't, yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, um, yeah, so it's supposed to help with your hands, okay? And then, of course, it comes with very, very sharp tweezers, so please be careful. And it comes with a heart-shaped um, container where you have the wax. And the wax, as you can see, it has a little plastic, so you have to peel it back so you're able to get the wax. All right let's see and of course it has a cover minder which this is a shell and it is just basically a magnet so all the the paintings come with the plastic you peel the plastic back you put the little shell on top of the plastic you take the magnet you put it underneath the canvas it snaps and it holds the plastic back and of course you get also some washi tape which i love washi tape Let's see if I can get it. Uh, let's see. This one's pretty. This one has little flowers. Purple flowers with yellow in the middle. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's try that again. Let's try that one more time, guys. All right. There you go. There you go. See? It's very pretty. All right. So let's put that over here. We don't need that piece right now. Oh, and of course, let's not forget the tray. All right. So let's go put all these wonderful goodies aside and if you're a newbie if you're a beginner at diamond painting you have everything in the kit uh, in order for you to start diamond painting okay so now let's look at the canvas now uh the artist is nini thomas and what do we know about nini so nini is a very well let's see if i can get this open <laughs> it's a very well known artist who specializes in fantasy art yep so she loves fairies she loves dragons. She loves and also um, painting beautiful women. Okay, so let's put that aside. All right. So here are the, the drills and the instructions. Here you have a thank you for your purchase, what's included in the kit, tips and tricks, and so on. And of course, step-by-step -step instructions. So we don't need that now. Here's the big sticker that I was talking about uh, earlier. Uh, here it tells you Dragon Artist by Nini Thomas. You write down your start date and when you finish it, you put your end date. And this can actually go in your logbook. All right. And then it comes with the pre cut stickers and you can actually put these on your container. And it, and it has 53 
colors all together. All right. And these are the drills. Wow. So what I love, it has a sticker and it says Dragon Artist. Just in case you separate the drills from the painting, you'll know that these drills go with that beautiful painting. All right, we're going to move this aside over here for now. And let's bring the canvas. Now the canvas is very smooth, smooth like butter, guys. Yep. So I'm just going to, I'm going to unroll it. And by the way, this is poured glue. So you can, I'm going to unroll it and then roll it like this because you can. And just to let, to flatten it out a little bit. And it does have scallop edges to prevent from fraying. All right. Now this is a big one, guys. I'm going to have to, I put the picture on my phone so I can see it better. Sometimes it's hard to see it when you're sitting down and this is this painting is big but it's beautiful guys wow my daughter is going to love this one she loves dinosaurs and she loves dragons now uh this painting okay let's see down here in the bottom it says take 10 for 10 percent off your next order and it says that you can find them on facebook and instagram here on the bottom left hand side, it basically has a picture of it. It says DAC, Dragon Artist. It tells you there's 29.5 inches by 27.6 inches, which is 75 centimeters by 70 centimeters. And it's by Nini Thomas. Um, do we see glare? Oh, mama mia. Let me, let me just push this a little back here. So we don't see that glare. Can we still, is that better? Oh, I think it's the light on the, on the ceiling. Okay. And then all the way on the top. So I'm going to slide it down. Can you see it? Yeah. It says, do what makes you sparkle by diamond or club. It's got a little diamond. And then on both sides, it has a legend. So there's basically two legends. So on the left, on the left top side, it has the legend. Okay. And then it has another legend on the bottom on the bottom of the right side, okay? So by looking at the legend, which I do use, some people don't, um, it basically tells you three important things, right? So it tells you the first row, it tells you that it's got 53 colors, and then the middle, those are the symbols, and the symbols are what you find in the painting, and that's where you're gonna place your drills. And then of course, the last row is the DMC code. And by looking at this, it looks like we have one, two, three ABs, all right, three ABs, and ABs is just Aurora Borealis, so it's just a drill with a special um, coating on top to make it extra shiny. And then on the bottom here, you have one, two, three, anything that starts with a Z, those are fairy dust diamonds. And those are also uh, a drill with a special shine to them. Sort of like, it looks like a glitter to me, I don't know, but it's very pretty. It makes the painting look very pretty. And now let's look at this beautiful painting. So what do we see? Let's see. So we see this beautiful young girl, young lady. Uh, she's got a ponytail. She's got long blonde hair. And she's wearing this beautiful Victorian dress. It's a gorgeous dress. Let me look at the painting here. It looks uh, on my phone. I can see it better. And then, of course, she's got, she's actually painting. Now, the question is, is she painting, uh, is she thinking of a dragon and she's painting the dragon on the canvas or is she actually painting like a statue i don't know what you call this like a like a dragon it is a dragon but like a statue of a dragon i have no idea but that's what she's doing and she's uh it looks like she's in a in some big room in her house and she's got beautiful big windows right i don't know if you can see the big windows here's one of them and lots of light coming in because you can see right here the light coming in and I'm not sure this is like a globe and then she's got some bottles back here some brushes some brushes here let's just look over here first because it is big guys um, let's see and then over here okay she's got an easel and then she's got a canvas so she's actually painting or she painted something else there and then she's got a little uh, actually, she's got books, so she's obviously a reader, so she's got books. 
I mean, she's educated. She's got jars, lots of candles. And then this here, I think this is like a flower. I love all the details of this, guys. And the rendering is amazing. Uh, let's see what else. And then here, she's got another easel, or a smaller easel on top of a desk, a beautiful desk, ornate desk. And then again, she's got more uh, bottles with brushes, more over here, jars, uh, mortal and pestle. Uh, let's see, let me move this a little bit more over here. Is that better? Okay. So over here she has, this looks like, oh, wait a minute, here, it looks like this is another table down here. It's another table. And then she's got a frame with her little pet, which is a little kitty cat. And then more brushes, more jars. And this looks like it's, um, it's a, a seashell. I think that's a seashell. And then over here, more books, more books, one on top of the other. Then you have another candlestick, a beautiful ornate candlestick with a candle. And here you have another one, but this one looks like the candle is almost finished. And here she has this beautiful ornate vase. And inside the vase, it looks like she keeps all the longer brushes. And let's not forget all the beautiful um, flowers that she has there. And then another huge candlestick here. And it looks like that's another candle. Yep. So, yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. All right. So, let's look at the drills now. And by the way, guys, since this is a new... Um, new painting the plastic covering i don't know if you can see it but it's perforated i don't know if you can see that see the line so basically you can just pull it out peel it and you can work on that section which is nice let me see if i can bring it up so you can see the, dra the dragon has a blue eye by the way let's see if you can see look at that look at that dragon look at that clear it is that goes in the window. Oh, by the way, how could I forget? There's a bird cage, but there's no bird. It looks like, well, it looks like the door is open, so maybe she lets the bird fly for a little bit. I used to have finches, and that's exactly what I did. I would let my little finches fly, and then I would just, they would go back in, the, in their little cage, bird cage. And there goes the beautiful girl, the artist. And then, look at that dress. Wow. The tail, the back of that um, the dress. And let's see if I can bring it up here in this section here so you can see the flowers, the brushes. There goes the frame with the kitty cat. Just gorgeous. All right, so I'm going to move this aside and I'm going to bring out the drills. I'll be right back. Okay. Let's begin. So here we have 935, which is a gray, 3041, it's like a pretty purple, 6021 is a gray, and 154 is another purple. And I think, let's see, right there is good. And I might bring this light a little closer now, because we do need it, okay? I think that's good. Here we have 435. Very shiny, all these drills, guys. It's like a mustard color. This is 356. 937. It's a green. And 453. Sort of like a light, light, light plum. Okay. Can you see that? No, you so I'm just going to put this over here. And let me bring one of these, 3350, sort of like in the red family. I'm going to put it here to hold this one down. Nope, not going to happen. Not happening, is it? All right, it's okay. Just move this one over here for now. And then 3865, it's like a white. This was 8.98 is a brown, and 452, again, like a light plum. Three eighteen. It's a pretty gray. 
3857, pretty brown. 3072 is a very light gray. And then you have 414, it's a gray. 451 and 300. Alright, and you have 434, sort of like in brown, yeah, 3778, 6031, and 436. Five, 553, it's like in the purple family, 611, sort of like in the olive family. 754, 936, green, and 931. Very pretty colors, guys. Okay, and then look at this. You have one, two, three, four, five bags of 413. And this is in the, it's a gray. It's a very pretty gray, actually. All right, put that there. Let's see, and then you have, let's pick this one here, 939, it's a uh, navy blue, it's like a navy blue, two bags. All right, so I'm going to have to move these out of the way, but as you can see so far, we have like in the plum all family, lots of grays, lots of browns, okay? All right, let's move these out of the way, because we need the space. those over there okay then you have 844 two bags of 844 and they're gray and then you have three bags of 310 which is black then you have three bags of 823 which is blue 646 it's in the gray family 158 it's like a blue purple 3834, like in the purple family, very pretty. And 3371, it's a very dark, dark chocolate. And 801, also light brown. And then you have two bags of 317, very pretty gray. 841, 3772. And two bags of 938, which is like a chocolate. And 3860, like a brown. Okay, can you see that? Yeah. Okay, almost finished. 648 is gray. 632, it's brown. 522, very pretty green. And 523, another green, but it's lighter than this one, than 522. Very pretty. Sort of like a sage. Okay. And then you have, wow, you have five bags of $37.99, which is like a shark, shark, charcoal? Like a, like a dark gray. Very pretty. And that's it. I love this, this green. Okay. So this one has lots of blues, lots of greens, and lots of browns. Now, let's bring out the ABs, okay? So we have 115 AB, which again, just means Aurora Borealis, and it's just a coating with an extra shine to it. And it's a very pretty green, uh, green. <laughs> it's a very pretty red. And by the way, this is a square painting, because I don't know if I mentioned it. This is 131 AB, very pretty yellow, very shiny. I love this one. This is 139, look at that, look at that shine. It's like gray. And now we have the Fairy Dust Diamonds, also an extra shine to them. It's like a mustard yellow. This is really pretty. This is like a blue green Z3809. Oh, by the way, this is Z437. And this is Z3837, and it's a purple, 
Now remember, whenever you see the Z at the beginning, it just means that it's a fairy dust diamond. All right, so we're gonna bring, bring back the painting and we're gonna figure out where these special drills go in that beautiful painting. Okay, I'm gonna need the space, so let's move all these stickers out of the way. Let's see. Now we look at, I'm gonna look at the, um, at the legend. And by looking at the legend, it tells me that 115 AB is symbol one in the painting. Okay, so we're gonna look for symbol one and it's red, so it shouldn't be uh, difficult for this one. Okay, so here, so I do need the, 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 the picture so I can figure out what this is. I think these are brushes. So you see them right there, all the little ones there? So those are the little brushes. And then over here, you have some more. And I think this is the, the, the decoration on the vase. Let's see, let's move it over here. Okay, you have more here. Those are the brushes. Uh, you have some here and here, all these are ones. And that, these are like jars and more, I think, these are books, these are books. And then she has a little bit more red here. And I think that's what's called, I think that's what's called a palette maybe. Uh, oh, wait, I gotta push this light again because or else you will see glare. Sorry about that. Okay, right there. And then of course she has one right there on her lip, which is her lipstick. Okay, perfect. All right, it's not a lot. It's very subtle, which I like. All right, so let's go to the next one. I'm looking at the legend and it says that 131 is symbol two. All right, so symbol two right here. It's the flowers. You have some here, which is, by the way, there's more here and that's flowers, flowers and flowers. And this here is, I think some jars, some jars, some liquid inside. I'm assuming it's paint. And again, here on the palette, because she's got uh, pink colors there. And that's about it, guys. It's very little of that one. All right, so let's go on to the next one. The next one is 139, and it's symbol three. Now, it is gray, so let's see. Okay, so you have some here, right here, in the mortal, right here in the mortar, Mortar and pestle. I think I'm pronouncing it correctly. Not sure. Uh, you have some here on the leaf. I think that's the leaf of the flower. Uh, any on the dragon? Let's see, because he is gray. Okay, yeah, right here. Oh yeah, back here on the back of the of the uh, dragon, and some here, some here, lots here in this area. And that is, oh, what is that? Let's see. Oh, that's the canvas. Yeah, that's part of the canvas. Uh, of course, you have it here where that is. I think those are like the, the, the claws. The claws, yep, the claws right here. Threes, threes of the dragon. Oh, so cool. <laughs> of course you have to have that because remember there's sunlight coming in and look at those big beautiful windows so you need to have that shine he has also on top of the dragon back here the dragon uh how about on her let's see on her beautiful dress i think this takes place in the 1800s guys because a beautiful victorian i don't know if it's victorian 1800s the dress um and then of course some here Lots of little threes here. Oops. And that is, oops, upside down. I think that's, those are jars. Oh, candle jar. Not sure. And then more here. And I think that's the wall, like the ledge. And yeah. Okay. Brilliant. And then the next one, did we do all three ABs? Yes, we did. All right. So this one is Fairy Dust Diamond. And a Z437, and that's gonna be capital letter J. So let's start. It's on her hair, guys, because of the light coming in. So she's got like some highlights. There's some on, I think, on the birdcage. Yep, 
right here. That's gonna look pretty. Some there, some there. Uh, none there. Okay, you have some down here. That's the candlestick over here. I believe that's another candlestick. Um, right over here. I think those are the brushes. And I think that's it. All right, let's move on to the next one. This was Z3809, and this is going to be a heart, shape of a heart. Is it on the flowers? Nope. Ha ha ha, right here. And what is that? Let's see. Ooh, Mamma Mia. I don't know. I think it's just jars, more jars. Um, let's see, heart. I think that's it. Very little of that one. Ah, I think it's in the eye. Yep, the eye of the dragon. That's gonna look pretty. Okay, and I think we have one more. This is the last one. It's Z3837 Fairy Dust. And let's see. I don't even know what it looks like. It looks like an X. Uh, well, it's like purple. So let's see. Is it here? Because I see a lot of purple here. This is a bottle. Yep. There's some there. It's like a big bottle. And she uses it, I think, for probably, maybe, I don't know if it's a wine bottle or is it for, for her paint brushes. And let's see you have some here so this this one is a, a little bit like scattered oh you have some on the flowers and some here what is that i think more jars i'm not sure yeah but that's it guys this is going to be so beautiful when it's finished when it's completed i hope you love this painting as much as i do and uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the week. And thank you.